let's see. I will invite Esther and my school friends and my aunts and uncles. Hey, Emmett, you look like you're making a list. Hi, Esther. I sure am. And you're on it. That's great. I think, depending on what kind of list it is. I was just thinking that one day, when we don't have to keep physically distancing from everyone, people will be able to once again have birthday parties and stuff. So you're making a list of people you would invite to a party. Yup. That looks like it's getting to be a long list. Yup. Hmm. I wonder... If I'm checking it twice. No! I was just thinking that your list is long, but God's list would be even longer. You mean, if God were having a birthday party? Well, yes. I mean, just think. Who do you invite to your birthday parties? Want me to read the list? No, no, no. I mean, think of who we invite to parties. We invite family and friends. Well, it is easier to make a list if you know people's names. If parents are celebrating a birthday, they invite their children. Usually, yeah. Well, don't our ministers at Transcona Memorial, Carol and Jeff, always say that we are all children of God? That's right. So we're all related. If I'm going to invite all my relatives, I need a longer list. I need more paper. Relax. I'm sure your list is just fine as it is. Whew. Say, do you think God has a staff who send out God's party invitations? I think God has something bigger than a staff. A delivery service? Sort of. Delivery people. Delivery people? Like you. Delivery people? Like me? Do I get to drive a truck? No, but you get to deliver, to distribute, to bring to others God's love. You get to share God's love. I get to share God's love. Wait, you do that, Esther. You share God's love. You must be one of God's delivery people. We're all supposed to share God's love because we are all children of God. God loves all of us, and we can remind each other of God's love by loving each other, by being kind to each other, caring about each other. We can each be one of God's delivery people. Right. Jesus told his disciples to tell everyone about God's love and compassion, and to heal people, and to share meals with people. It's like Jesus gave them each a parcel labeled God's love and said, now, Go deliver this. And if they were to deliver it to everyone on God's list of God's children. That's a lot of deliveries. Deliveries are made every time we hug someone or send them a note saying someone is special or appreciated. Or we go for ice cream with someone. Or, or we invite someone to a party. Or wave to them. Or help them tend their garden. Or, or, or. We can come up with lots of ways to share God's love. To deliver God's love. Although I'd still like to drive one of those delivery trucks. Maybe one day, Emmett. But until then, everyone can keep on delivering God's love in all sorts of ways. We're God's delivery people. Thanks be to God. Amen. Amen.